What's going on there, friends? My name is MCD and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Crystal. In the last episode, uh, we defeated Chuck and Jasmine of the Eager Teak Gym, and now, or I mean, in the uh, Alvine and uh, Sienwood uh, City Gym. And now, in this episode, we're going to go uh, right to Eager Teak City, so let's make way. Alright. And heading over here to Route 42, we have some awesome stuff. First up, we have an Ultra Ball right there. That is the TM for Shadow Claw if you're playing the remake instead, which I don't think Shadow Claw really existed back then. New Pokemon you can find here in Route 42, you can find Furos and Crystal only, Arbox and Crystal only, Golbats and Crystal only, Mankey and Gold only, Meryl and Crystal only, and Flaffy in Gold and Silver only. And then, here we have a really optional cave to go through. You can actually skip this cave just from surfing uh, through this route. But I'm actually going to show this cape off. Um, in Mount Warner, we have you can find Machops, Machokes, and Gravelers. Those are your new Pokemon. So uh, yeah. All right. Um, I believe I spare. I believe I have a, rep I have a Repel sprayed. Uh, I think I don't exactly remember. I do have some Super Repels though. Uh, I bought I bought some Super Repels off screen, so so uh, that should be really awesome. Uh, so yeah. All right. Uh, so, um, for Mount Mortar, um, I'm not gonna really, I'm gonna explore as much as I can, and, uh, and, and then, uh, I'll go back later on once we actually have, once we are able to access more of Mount Mortar, so, for now I'm just gonna explore whatever we can explore, um, so, uh, yeah. Alright, so this is what this is what it looks like when you use strength. Actually, why am I saying that? We ever we've already experienced what strength looks like because we because we had to use strength in order to go through Chuck's gym. Over here, you can get yourself a hyper potion. Very nice item. And then uh, progressing onwards up here, we have another item, which is an ultra ball. Okay. And uh, there's another item. Oh, and we have another item over here. It's a nugget, which is actually a, a selling item that I believe you sell it, you get five thousand dollars off of it, which is actually a lot of money. Very, uh, very helpful. Uh, very good uh, selling item if you if you are a if you're a person who who, li who likes to have a lot of money and you want to get rich and famous. Okay, well maybe maybe not the famous part, but yeah. And there's also trainers here. I forgot to mention. I forgot to mention that uh, off screen, um, I actually uh, bought the TM for Ice Punch from the Goldenrod Department Store, and I uh, taught it to Will, uh, so that way Will can handle flying types easier, as well as some other po uh, as well as some other Pokemon that are weak to ice. Very nice, very uh, nice uh, item. All right, and I believe that is all we can actually do for now. So I'm going to go over here. And is there anything else on this rock? Nope. Okay, we're good. All right, and here we are, Route 42. Hey, this is your secret place. What are you talking about? Wait, what? Why are you telling me to get lost? There's like plenty of other people here. Why don't you tell them to get lost? I don't understand how a freaking Doug Trio can use Scratch when it doesn't even have any hands. Okay. Uh, 
This is one of those trainers where you want that you want to fight because if you talk to him uh, or if you register his number, he'll give you a water stone. So you can evolve Poliwags and, and, and Eevee to Vaporeon. So that's really cool. And since I and and so there's so I register a trainer that, that gives you a leaf stone, a fire stone, a thunder stone, and a trainer that gives you a water stone. So that is all four of those uh, so that's all four of those trainers that give you evolutionary stones. So, uh, yeah. And since I registered all four of them, now you guys really don't know which Eevee type I'm gonna be using. Alright, anyway. Uh, could be over here. This tree can be cut. Use cut. Alright, use cut over, over here. And we have a Suicune. Oh my. Where'd he go? I wonder. All right, and and here in this part of Mount Mortar, um, well, you can't really do much here in this part of Mount Mortar. Um, there, well, actually, you can, uh, but I'm gonna save that part of Mount Mortar for like uh, way later in the game because because right now we don't have the proper uh, HM moves to actually uh, to actually access. Um, that that part of Mount Mortar because there's because that part gives you will give you the big portion of of of, uh, of the dungeon. So anyway, here we are in Mahogany Town. Okay, as you can see, we have a gym. It is blocked by some fat dude that we're not going to bother. And if you try to leave town, this guy will give you a Rage Candy Bar for about like two hundred dollars. And by the way, don't buy it. It's not worth it. So okay. Anyway, let's move on to this this route. This is Route 43. Uh, let's see. New Pokemon you can find here. You can find Venomoth and Crystal only, and or yeah, Venomoth and Crystal only, Barrettes and Crystal only, and Girafferig in Gold Silver only. So very very ni very nice. So uh, yeah. Anyway. Hello. You can do so much with your Pokemon, it's very, very, very fun. Alright, Charmix finally learned Bite! About time you learned something that's like, that's not a normal move. Well, well I guess technically if, if you if you count the TM Shadow Ball. Uh, you don't want to know what happens if you go inside this building. So, I recommend don't go in there at all. Alright, anyway. Uh, let's, so instead we're going to go up here. Excuse me. And go through the grass. Because we're not, because we're not, we're not about to find out. Yes, I'm going to the Lake of Rage. Uh, let's play for a while. Okay, we'll play for a while. Alright, continuing onwards. Um, I'm gonna go past you. And if you head over here, you get yourself a Max Ether, which uh, heals all power points for a move. And my Repel wore off. Okay, and hello. Do I have any rare Pokemon? Yeah, I do have a couple rare Pokemon. It doesn't make sense why Sonic Boom and Gus both have, both have the same attack animation. That makes no sense at all. What I get this? Some Vince guy made fun of my Pokemon.
Alright, I'm supposed to go up there, but before I go up there, there is actually something if I go down over here. What the heck? Fisherman noob number two. I I hate I hate trainers who do that. Magic carps like takes so long. Welcome to the Lake of Rage, by the way. Uh, here in the Lake of Rage, you can find Magic carps and Gyarados only. Yep. Uh, so right there is a full restore, uh, which is a healing item that heals status infliction and all of your HP. Very very good item. However, because it's so good, I don't recommend using it using uh, using it a lot. Plus, they're really expensive when you buy them. All right, let's see. Uh, anything right there? No, there's not. Let's see what's going on over here. Uh, hidden item, rare candy. All right. Okay. Um. Yeah, we're gonna go through this little maze area. That's that, and they took this maze away in um, the remake. Actually, no, it's not- actually, no, they didn't really- they didn't exactly take it away, because, uh, ugh. There's actually a, uh, maze that you have to go through in- in, uh, just from surfing. In, uh, in the remake instead. Okay, which direction? Left or right? I'm gonna go right first. Uh, wow, okay, Repellus Effect wore off, apparently. Okay, TM-43, and that TM contains- let me check that real quick. Detect, okay, that's a... Uh, I say it's a really terrible move. It prevents uh, your opponent from attacking. Uh, which I think it's... I don't even think that's good. So, yeah. Because it, because it just wastes a turn. I've strayed far. Here, I've, I, I have meditated inside me. A new power has, has been awakened. And with that, you get TM10 for a hidden power. Um... It is, uh, basically, um, okay, this is what he's saying right here. It's type and power depend on the Pokemon using it, so, that means any Pokemon can have any type of hidden power. So, now you, now on the, um, hit, on the move description, it may, it, it, it says normal. It does not mean it is a normal type move. So, just keep that, so keep that in mind. It's pretty, it just, it's random. It gives it, it's it, it, it's random so all right and uh, finally we have an elixir which is actually a better item than an ether because it actually heals uh, power points for all moves for the for the whole move set really, really good and that is uh, that and that's that so we're going to now get out of here and, yeah, we're, so now we're gonna get the heck out of here and actually move on to the actual Lake of Rage itself. If I can get out of here, because this is really slow right now. I should be biking, which I don't know why I'm not biking, but whatever. It's, it's fine. I got this. I'm gonna spur, I'm gonna, oops, no, I don't want to, I don't want to do that. I want to do this. There we go. Okay, you want know to screw this? This is this is so slow. All right, here we are to Lake of Rage. Normally it'd be raining here, but rain, uh, but outside of battle, rain does not exist. So, okay. Uh, no, I do not want to do that. Oh wow, I actually not I actually did not know that that item was there. I was just out of curiosity. But uh, okay. All right, let's surf. And what do you know? We have. Where is he? Oh, here you are. Look at this. Look at this bad boy. All right. Uh, let's uh, let's have Jay up front. Oh man, here we go. We're about to catch a really awesome Pokemon. It's a Gyarados. Yasha. Okay. Here we are. Time to go against a Gyar. It's time to go against a Gyarados. Holy crap, it is shiny. Oh my god. 
How awesome is that to find a shiny Pokemon? All right. Oh yeah, you're gonna use Thrash. Oh my God, Thrash is such a powerful move. I hate that move. Oh my God, you're gonna kill me already. You're gonna kill me already. Gosh dang it. Okay, well, well, Jay is out already. Okay, good. I, I almost uh, said no. That would have been bad. All right. Uh, let's go for Will. Since the since the shiny Gyarados is on level 30 and and I uh, and I'm on level 30 and Will is on level 34. I really want you to I really want you to flinch from this bite. Okay, so that's what Thrash do it does. It pretty much locks it locks in. Okay, I'm gonna okay I'm I'm really scared right now. I'm really afraid if uh. If you might hurt, kill yourself in confusion, so I don't want you to do that. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, uh, just go. I'm just gonna go all, all out with the pokeballs now. See, so yeah, Thrash pretty much just locks in on. You keep using Thrash until you get confused. Oh my God, I was so close, man. Are you serious? Oh, you also have bite. Okay. All right, I'm gonna go for another bite. All right. Okay, I'm I'm wanting I'm waiting to know what your fourth move is. So uh Because I actually forgot to I actually forgot to do some research to know to figure out what Gyarados uh, do, uh to what to what this Gyarados has. But there we go, we caught the shiny Gyarados. Such a rare opportunity to, to find a shiny Gyarados. So uh yeah. And because I'm not gonna use it on my team, I'm going to uh not nickname it, and there we go, we got ourselves a red scale. Very, very nice. What do you do with the red scale exactly? Well, you'll see. Hey, it's you! This lake is full of Gyarados, but nothing else. So the Magikarp are being forced to evolve. Uh, I came here because I felt like it, sir. Your Lance, a trainer like you, oh my god. Okay. I am a trainer with considerable skill. Oh, please, I'm not that good. Sure, I'll help you. Match cards are being forced to evolve. Wow. Ooh, really? Okay. All right. Well, before I make way to Mahogany Town, I'm gonna make way uh, to Mr. Pokemon's house. Now that we have the red scale. Okay, here we are to Mr. Pokemon's house. Bring him the red scale right here. A red Gyarados, yep, that is rare. You want it? Here you go. And with that, we get ourselves the experience share. Which uh, shares experience with Pokemon that are not that did not battle at all. Very helpful item. I will definitely keep it uh, uh, use that for my last team member, which like I said, it's not gonna come for a long while. So we still got a long ways to go, so I'm gonna be very overpowered uh, for a while. Alright, uh whoops, I I did not mean to fly to the Lake of Rage, so let me uh, try that again. There we go, I want to fly back to Mahogany. And next time on Pokemon Crystal, we're going to make way over here to this building, which is... Um... While well, Mahogany trying to buy a Rage Candy Bar, okay, uh, alright. Okay, well apparently I okay. Well apparently I was thinking of, I was I was once again thinking of the remake because this side in the remake would say nothing suspicious is going on here. Well, I don't trust that. So we're gonna see if this sign is telling the truth or not. See you guys next time. Bye bye.